the crowd as well. It'll be the Polish captain to get us back underway. Borowski over the ball. Thinks about going himself. He's walked into a wall of trouble there. They weren't four metres, which they have to be. So Poland will have the ball. Remember, you can shoot from anywhere inside the attacking half. Just got to move the ball four metres first. Now then, Kropersky onto the foot. He'll get the advantage from that. Might still fancy it himself. There was nothing coming off that foul. No advantage. So Poland ball inside the attacking half. And a challenge given. So it was Raheel hadn't retreated the four metres. They will confer. But certainly from this angle, and it's not the best angle, we were right behind that passage of play. I think this is going to be given as a challenge. So the equivalent of a penalty. Taken 10 metres from the goal. No, nope, cancelled out. So Sean Edwards had a better view of it than all of us. Conferred there with Sophie Bothman who wasn't sure. That's the whole advantage, really, of having two umpires umpiring the match. Different angles, certainly from our angle, which was behind the play. It looked like it wasn't four metres. But Sean Edwards would have had a side-on view there and believed it was. So, back to business. A bobbly one here in front of the goal. And the equaliser comes. It's Bobby. Dami Bobby Singh. Gets India's equaliser to make it three all. And after a horror start for India, they're back in this match. They went behind to three very early goals from Poland. And now they've drawn level. So earlier today, this match finished 6-2 in the round robin stage, match 17 of the tournament. It's already three all and it promises plenty more goals in this match. Another long distance shot, glove save from Pobielowski. This is what it's all about. This is what it boils down to. The next eight and a half minutes to decide the first ever champion of the Hero FIH Hockey Fives. The inaugural tournament as far as the seniors go in this Senior World Hockey Fives competition. Tight angle shot. It was uh, ambitious to say the least from Moore. That was slightly more like it from Raheel. You just see hardly a backlift at all to generate that much power, looking for his ninth goal of the tournament and his shot there is parried over and that's into the food stand and probably into someone's hot dog. And he goes himself! Poland was slow to react. He took it from the 10 metre line. They didn't retreat. And India have taken the advantage. He does get his ninth. Look, he just asks, is that the right spot? Yes, it is. Off he goes right through the middle and slots it past Popiolowski. India take the lead for the first time in this match. Now, Poland, do they have a reply? Oh! Seven and a half minutes remaining. India four, Poland three. The use of the sideboards to keep the ball active and in play. It's Poland now that have to come up with the answers. Having led 3-0, they trail by four goals to three. Graham Reed, unaffected by the pressure. He's been there. And it's the men's team that won the bronze at the 2020 Summer Olympics. And bringing that wealth of experience here. India, of course, the world number four side in the outdoor form of the game. The 11 aside game that's just got on the wrong side of the netting. Well, a good effort from Rutkowski. He already has one today in this men's final. The wrong side of the netting. Now we're off with Gasabaji. Crosses it, no one there, far post. Summit might fancy it if he can get his stick on it, which he can't. Bit of a wrestle for the ball here. We'll check Rutkowski coming away with it and winning the free hit for Poland. Just taking a breath. Still a long way to go in this one. India, the comeback kings if they win this one. 3-0 down. But Poland haven't given up the ghost just yet. Certainly going to be plenty more bites of the cherry as India look to expose 
those gaps and those spaces to give them the shooting opportunity. Sanjay this time wiggles free, looks to take it on the half volley, but has it pinched away from him by Karovsky. Karovsky himself now lays the ball off. It was a little heavy to Rudkowski and cleared off the goal line. There was a little foul just there. Well, tense times for all involved. Little deflection. Enough from Summit Stick to take it over. Take it over the crossbar. And Holland will go. Might need to change the angle a little bit here as Kapersky comes out. Actually, back into his own half. Plays in his captain, Karowski. Down the right hand boards. Kopsky, they're putting on a little bit of pressure, the number 24, and Poland take the opportunity to make a four-man change. So fresh legs coming on. The goal is still the same. They need at least one goal to get this one back. Could have been a shot from right on the halfway line there from Evanek. Oh dear, this could be trouble. Kasabaji gives chase, but the keeper had to come for it, make sure and belted out into touch. There is a ball on the pitch, a couple of balls on the pitch. Yeah, the pace has just come down a bit. Ever since India have got back into this game and taken the lead, it's the first time the game has really settled down, but it's taken about 15 minutes to settle down. The first 10 minutes was explosive. The comeback from India was impressive. Now they've got the chance to win it, but Poland looking to go one themselves. A good left-hand glove save from Sanjay, from uh, Pavan. Helped out that time by Gurinda, the captain. Now, a bit more space here for Poland. Long distance shot goes wide, but watch out for the rebounds. Caught so many teams out this week in Lausanne. The evening sunshine comes out. Camera one almost takes an absolute melting. Ricochet's back into the field of play so we're back underway with Poland here attacking the goal to our right hand side as those evening shadows cast down on the blue pitch here inside the harbour Ushi Ushi Olympique one final blast from India as Raheel tears down the left hand flank and lets rip they all want a piece of the action. Here's Raheel again, just cuts inside. He's got himself plenty of space on the half volley and scores! Raheel for India! India take the lead. They extend it by two goals now. Raheel, look at this, just carves in field. Raheel to real. Unbelievable from the little man. And that is number five for India. Two for Raheel this evening. Oh, what a response! The Polish captain has produced a net buster down the other end. And he says, have some of that. We're not done yet. Poland take their mark back inside their own half. It's 5-4, India 5, Poland 4. What about this for a response from the Polish skipper? Kurowski! Under two and a half minutes left. India five, Poland four. Going down to the wire. Oh, where's that one gone? <laughs> a little bit slack from Bobby. That's uh, the lamest pass we've seen all day. Still unfazed. Only just holding firm. Still got that one goal advantage. Two minutes remaining. Poland will have to start pushing forward and taking a few more risks, which might expose them to the elements and a counter-attack from India. Trying to get out of trouble from that bottom left-hand corner. Never a nice place to find yourself. Bobby's going to have a chance for the lob, and it's gone in! Bobby scores! And that could be it. That could be the icing on the cake for the Indian fans and for Team India back home. One minute left to play, and Bobby goes and produces the goods here. Just a little bounce and then a little tip over the six foot two goalkeeper, Poppy Olovsky, to make it six. It's six four now. Bobby with his second. And you get a feeling that could be curtains. Or could it? Well, the foot there was Chizinski. 
confirmation there of Bobby's second goal, the third and sixth goal today for India. Oh, they're going to enjoy this, not just in Lausanne, but back home all over India, all over the continent. There's going to be parties in the streets. They're going to win the inaugural Hero FIA Hockey Fives. A new era for the sport, a new version of the sport. But again, one that the eight-time Olympic gold medalists look to dominate. Final few seconds into the final 30. Still that two-goal lead that they've got, 6-4. India look to come forward once more, one final push. Time running out for Poland. They're not going to do it. They might get one more goal. Whistle goes. And the fans start celebrating here in Lausanne, and they're all up, off their feet. India have won the Hero FIH Hockey Fives tournament in Lausanne. And the music starts blaring out here to celebrate those six goals. Graham Reed onto the pitch to congratulate his players.